sketches are one of the few objects in this digital age and virtual reality time which can still amaze us with their mechanical mastery. So I have chosen those watches that I think are mechanically superb and also fill us with wonder. And one of the most talked about pieces of the show is Roger Dubuis' life-size cuckoo clock that you can see behind me. On a slightly smaller scale, Roger Dubuis has made the quatuor with its four balance springs that brings the dial to life with its constant whirring and movement. Highly technical watches have traditionally been the preserve of men, but Richard Miller this year has made a big effort to bring some very special watches for women. One of the first ones I saw was a Natalie Portman watch with a spider on the dial and on the back is a cobweb dotted with black sapphires. If you look closely, you can see there is a tourbillon in the abdomen of the spider and its intricate design is both like a jewel and a racing machine for the wrist. The Crouching Tiger Watch by Richard Miller is to celebrate Michelle Yeoh's sequel to Crouching Tiger Hidden Dragon. And as you can see in amongst the complex mechanics are a little tiger and a dragon. The skeleton watch is one of the most aesthetically beautiful complications and Piaget, masters of the ultra-thin movement, take it even further by setting the entire movement with diamonds. The result is light as air and absolutely spectacular. Sometimes a hugely complicated watch is simply not enough to satisfy the most demanding collectors. So Jaeger Lacoutre created this grand complication that packs in not only a minute repeater and a tourbillon and a celestial calendar, but it's also nicely loaded with 50 carats worth of diamonds that add up to almost a million euros. If you want to know all that's happening in the world of jewelry and watches, visit my website.